Hi guys, this is Kenya. Welcome back to Kenya's Decor Corner. So today we're gonna hop right into this video. As you can see, my husband is cutting the grass. We're working in the yard because we're going to be putting out our fall decor in the front yard. Yes, I'm super excited. Even though the temperatures have been in the triple digits, we're getting an early start. So it's about 7.30 in the morning and the temperature is already 85 degrees. So we will be done before it gets to the triple digits. So guys, if you are new here, welcome. I hope that you will go ahead and click the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell so you will not miss any upcoming videos. For my faithful family members, you guys know I love you so much. And guys, we're gonna go ahead and hop right into this video. Okay guys, so I have pulled out my fall decor for the yard and I'm using the same items that I use all the time. The only thing new is the happy fall sign that uh, happy fall rug that I showed you guys when I did my unboxing of fall decor. I did purchase that last year and I have my hello fall sign that I got from Hobby Lobby years ago. So yeah, that is it. Um, I am out here early. You guys saw that my husband cut the grass already and he started like at 7.30 I think this morning and now it's about 9 and it's already super hot. I, I think it's already like 90 degrees. So I'm going to just get this out as quickly as possible. So this is going to be a pretty short video um, and I may add some more things in a little bit later but for today I'm just going to put this out. I'll put a few things out on the porch and then as we go along into fall and as things cool down a bit I might add a few more items but for now this is what we'll be working with so let's go ahead and get started decorating. Guys, as you can see, my pumpkins are getting old. I've had these for at least six years now. I did purchase them from Hobby Lobby and the little metal legs on them are breaking off or some of them they've already come off. And this one, the legs are like barely hanging on. So I was trying to poke the legs down into the dirt. Um, I should probably just take them off. It would be easier. And my husband did ask me, he was like, is this year the last year you're going to use those pumpkins and you're just going to throw them away? And I was like, no, I love my pumpkins. Like, I don't want to give them away or throw them away. I love them. Um, one or two of them are kind of sun bleached. And so I might, should get rid of them. But I think I'm going to try to paint them myself and, you know, rekindle the look of them I don't know just yet but 
for now. I'm still using them. I still love them. Um, and the price has like doubled. So I don't want to buy any more. I'm just going to keep using them until they completely disintegrate. <laughs> so, um, but I'm going to fool around with this a little bit more. And then usually I use zip ties or chenille stems to just attach them to the tree. So, because we are still in hurricane season, so I do attach them so that if you know heavy winds come they will um, be secured in place so they don't fly away So Addison and my husband bought me this plant um, months ago. I don't know, it was, I don't know, maybe like for Valentine's Day or something. And it was in the house and then it was on the back porch and it didn't do that well in the house, but when I put it on the back porch, it started doing really well. So I decided to move it here to the front porch because I thought it would be perfect for fall. And I think it's really pretty and it's actually doing really well. And I think it will like it here in this spot. Okay guys, I hope you all have enjoyed this video. If so, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. You know that helps me out tremendously. Also, it helps me leave comments, so be sure to leave me a comment down below to let me know what you think. And also, here is a view of our front yard at nighttime. I did want to just show you guys how I have the up lights on the pumpkins, so they're kind of illuminated. I think that makes it extra special and really cute. Um, so again, if you're new here, welcome. I hope that you will go ahead and click the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you will not miss any upcoming videos. For my faithful family members, you guys know I love you so very much. And of course, I look forward to seeing all of you on the next video. Much love and many blessings. Bye-bye.